What's good, LOP fam? We're back with another reaction. Gonna be reacting to Tom McDonald, Dear Rappers. Now, I've heard a couple Tom McDonald tracks. He's just, I feel like the best word for him to woke, to be honest, because he, he addresses things the way he sees them. He doesn't censor himself, which in the world that we live in is, is a rarity nowadays. So I'm excited to get into this. Now, a bunch of you people actually told me in the comments for, I think it was uh, People So Stupid, Someone had mentioned this this track and told me that basically he got some backlash from it and then he made a response to that, which he also got got backlash for, and then eventually made a third response which was called White Boy. So I'm planning on doing all three of those. If I'm not mistaken, the response after this one was hell of it. Um and then White Boy after that. So I'm excited to get into this. I want to see what he's talking about. Dear rappers, I mean Tom McDonald would no would no censorship addressing the rappers i'm excited to see what he's about to say so let's get into this one let's see what he's got man it's easy for these rappers who have it all talk about the days when they used to be sad i guess i can't relate to being famous and wealthy i'm 28 and still praying for the day i have a chance maybe y'all can help me out Woo! though he's saying it's easy for these rappers to have it all to play and act sad and then he's saying how he's he's 28 and he's still praying for the chance to become famous he's still he's still waiting he's praying on that on that chance help me out though i'm just trying to take care of my household i don't even want to make my mouth go i just want to win before mm. the system that i'm in gets a hold of me again and starts to squeeze under my chin until i'm out cold Ooh. dear rappers can you help me i'll even take a selfie with your album that i bought i got every single cd that you ever fucking dropped i spent everything i had and i never had a lot oh my god what a mess your words help me deal with the stress used to contemplate my suicide the nights i was depressed used to pop you in a boom box and sit up on my desk listen to your music till i felt it in my chest but mm. these days Mmm, bro, he he's talking. I love how he brought up that mocking voice. Dear rappers, just please help me. Like, okay, he's talking his shit on this one. I feel like he's just he's just building up right now, though. I don't I don't think he's really going off yet, to be honest. All right, bro. Let's run this back a little bit. Here. Sit up on my desk, listen to your music till I felt it in my chest. But these days it's like you don't have nothing left. Your music feels kind of like you're trying to write a check. Everything mm. is digital. I mean no disrespect, but I'm paying even more, and you give me even less. What the fuck? Ooh. You taught me to. Ooh. This is okay. See, I heard somebody talking about. I can't remember who it was. Oh, I think it was Gary Vaynerchuk. If you guys don't know him, go check him out. He's amazing. But he was talking about this. He was saying how a lot of artists give it their all and then once they make it they stop giving it as much and they just start milking the fan base for as much cash as they can this that's not how it works you have to keep producing you have to keep giving value for your dollar and that's what he's referencing right now in this track he's saying you're you're just making music for the checks you're just making the music that's going to get you the biggest amount of money and you're not you don't care about the content anymore you let that go as, so, as soon as you saw a check you let that all go out the window this is this is some real shit right here you give me even less what the fuck you taught me to think you taught me to grow you taught me the things to survive on my own but now you teach me to drink you teach me to smoke mm -hmm. you teach me to think every woman's a hoe I... bro come on man come on bro don't sleep on tom mcdonald bro that's yo this dude said you taught me how to grow you taught me how to think you were actually teaching me useful things and once you made it, now all you do is teach me how to drink and teach me how to get hoes. Like, you're basically teaching me nothing now. You're just telling me, oh, bro, come on. Smoke, you teach me to think. Every woman's a hoe. I don't want your Xanax bars or your fancy foreign cars. Throw your money in my face and try to tell me that it's dark. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Yeah, just a drug addict. I can't hear another Ooh. fucking song about abusing medication that I had to take just to stay alive There's more Ooh. important shit than what you wear and where you live and who you fucking what you drink and what you spend and what you drive Rappers full of bullshit rappers just a marketing vehicle for the pro Yo, he's going bro. <laughs> he's going off He's addressing everything down to the T. I don't want to hear about the pills that you take for fun That I have to use to keep me alive. I don't want to hear about it. Oh my god he even said just before that your music is just money thrown in my face basically you tell me about the foreign cars you tell me about all of this like it's not music anymore you're just throwing money 
market. Rapper's just a marketing vehicle for the product that the man wants you to buy. Rap mm. about a phone clip. Rapper's just promoting different liquors and varieties of ways that you could die. Yo. Woo. Dear rappers, can you help me? Are you almost out of alcohol to sell me? Tell me. Cause drinking every night can be the way to getting wealthy. If I'm really being honest, all the shit is overwhelming. I need someone to look up to. You're living in a country that elected Donald Trump. You're living mm. in a country where police are killing people every day. And all you want to talk about is doing drugs. You've been blinded by the money. You Come on, bro. Stop sleeping on Tom McDonald. Oh, my God. He's saying you live in a country that elected Donald Trump. You live in a country with police brutality. And all you're talking about is, is, is this? This is all you got to talk about? There's actual real subjects that we need to address right now. But the money got you corrupt. Oh my God. Let's go, bro. Let's go. This is sick. How did he get hate for this? What part of this got him hate? This is just facts. Trump, you're living in a country where police are killing people every day and all you want to talk about is doing drugs. You've been blinded by the money. You've been blinded by the cars. You've been blinded by the women. Don't know who the fuck you are. Thought I knew you when I spent $100 on a ticket to your show and now I feel like you stole my fucking money and I'm broke. Man, you taught us how to rap and you taught us how to dress and you taught us how to act if we wanted to impress. Now you're teaching me to live like I know you never would. What you're preaching to these kids is keeping them inside the hood. your zany your fancy foreign cars. Throw your money in my face. And try to tell me that it's art No, 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 no No, 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 no. Just a drug addict don't I don't want your Xanax bars Or your fancy foreign cars Throw your money in my face And try to tell me that it's art No, 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 no No, 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 no Just a drug addict Damn, yo. Is he just gonna ride out the beat here? Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, man. I was not expecting that. That's straight facts. I don't know. Like, let me know in the comments who gave him hate for that because that's just straight facts. He said nothing. He said nothing that was like, he didn't step out of line at any point. Like, he didn't directly diss anybody. He's just talking about what's going on in the industry and all he spit was facts. People are just corrupted. I've been saying this. That's, that's why all we do is react to bars on this channel. I don't want none of that bubble mumble bullshit. Like none of that, none of that. I don't want to hear it. You recommend something like that. I'm not listening to it. It's not happening. We want straight bars because there's too much of that stuff. And all you rap about is the cars, the money, the drugs, the girls, the partying, like Come on, man. Oh man, this this track got me. This, this track got me feeling some type of way right now. We're gonna be reacting to a lot more Tom McDonald, man. This guy never fails to impress. It's just, oh man. All right, yo. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna react to hell of it. I don't know if I'm gonna do it right now, but I'm gonna definitely do it in the next couple of days for sure, for sure. So stay tuned for that. Smash that like button, hit that comment section, say what's up, tell me if you guys have any other song recommendations for Tom McDonald, any other artist, anything similar to this, this is crazy to me, and of course, of course, you gotta smash that subscribe, show some love, you already know what it is, I will catch you guys in the next one, but for this one, I'm out.